Yesterday, out of nowhere, Meta acquired Manus, a high-profile AI startup working on autonomous AI agents. Yet another, we're totally calm and not reacting to OpenAI move from big tech. This puts Meta back in direct competition with OpenAI, Google, and Anthropic, but not in chatbots. It is December 30th, 2025, and you're watching the Daily Dose of AI. For context, this isn't another chatbot UI slapped on a large language model. Manus focuses on agentic AI, systems designed to plan tasks, call tools, and execute multi-step workflows with minimal human input. Think early auto-GPT ideas, but productized, at least based on demos and reporting so far. Meta didn't announce the price, which usually means either very expensive or we don't want the internet yelling about it yet. Zoom out for a second. In 2024 and 2025, everyone shipped a chatbot. Chat was the feature. Chat was the demo. Chat was the pitch deck. The industry is moving past AI that answers questions toward AI that replaces workflows, booking meetings, running ads, handling support tickets, managing internal tools. OpenAI is building agents. Google is baking them into workspace. Microsoft is duct taping them into Copilot. Meta's problem? They don't own the enterprise stack, but they do own attention, creators, and small businesses, which is where Manus comes in. Here's what we actually know. Manus was building autonomous task agents, meaning goal decomposition, breaking tasks into steps, tool usage, APIs, browsers, internal systems, memory and state tracking, and execution loops that don't need constant prompts. The exact architecture isn't public, but this typically involves a foundation model for reasoning, a planner executor system, guardrails to avoid doing crimes. Meta hasn't confirmed how Manus will be integrated, but the obvious targets are WhatsApp business automation, ad campaign management creator tools, internal Meta workflows. In other words, agents that live inside Meta's platforms. Pricing, unknown. Public access, also unknown. Developer APIs, not announced, which is already a signal. But here's the thing. This isn't just about smarter AI. It's about control. If Meta's agents only work inside Meta's ecosystem, Developers get power with strings attached. Your automation depends on Meta APIs, Meta Data Access, Meta's product roadmap, and Meta has a long history of checks notes abandoning developer platforms when vibes change. Remember Parse, Workplace, Facebook Analytics, Half the Graph API? AI agents are officially the next platform war. Meta doesn't want to sell you tools. It wants to run the workflows inside its walled garden. That could be powerful. It could also disappear in two years, smash the like button, subscribe for more AI breakdowns, and ask yourself, are AI agents here to replace busy work, or just move it deeper into platforms you don't control? See you tomorrow.